Hello guys, my name is Brian Abarim and you're tuning in to the Brian Abarim Podcast where we talk about real life stories from real people. My name is Brian Abarim and you're tuning in to the Brian Abarim Podcast and it's available now on YouTube, Spotify and Apple Podcast. And for episode 19, I have two special guests of mine and this is the first time me doing this uh, where I have interviewed, no, where I have invited and I will interview a couple session this time where I have invited um, a married couple um, still fresh in their marriage life but um, <laughs> that is enough mm-hmm. to talk about their experience so without further ado um, Aisha and Farhan welcome to the Brain of Brain podcast Hi. Hi. thank you very much hey. thank you very much uh, sorry for the abrupt stop but <laughs> yeah, how are you guys now? how was the how was the lunch? how was the afternoon? Mm, it was great mm-hmm. we ordered beef noodles for lunch beef noodles for mm. lunch where is that? From Nuromen. Nuromen. <laughs> it's yeah, our favorite. Yeah, yeah. It's Nuromen. our favorite noodles. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Nuromen is nice. Yeah, 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 yeah. We stayed in because uh, at our housing area it was raining heavily. Ah. Yeah, so we decided to just stay home <laughs> until our recording session yeah, for yeah, this yeah, afternoon. Yeah. Mm, mm, <laughs> all right, all right. Nuromen. Mm. Uh, where else do you get your beef noodles besides Nuromen? Mm. Kubari ah. Kuba, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Which part? Kubari. Uh, nya kedai nombor 15. Ah. Uh, I think if I'm not mistaken it's called Mikolo Amoy. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, the best. Yeah. <laughs> the Ooh. best yang one. Yeah. All right. Mm. Beef noodles. Mm. Okay, when I when we talk about Kubariana, there's mm. this there's this spot, there's this stall that I would love to go lah. Nasi yeah. lemak. Eh. Nasi lemak ganja. Oh yes, 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 yes. Mm. Everyone yeah. says it's nice. But yeah. I haven't tried it. Yeah, because yeah. uh, uh, he hasn't tried it because he doesn't go out that much. Oh, okay. yeah, okay. He's, yeah. Fun he's, fact. he's a hermit. Ah, <laughs> yeah. 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 Hermit. Okay. While okay. I can't handle spicy stuff. Ah, mm. fun, fun, fun. Like me, I have gastric. So. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, what to do? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Come the yeah. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Just bring me. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. All right. So, all right. Uh, Aisha and Farhan. Mm-hmm. Yes. Um, one of your favorite things to do, not favorite things now. What would you do if you're, let's say, on weekends like this? Mm-hmm. What do you guys usually do, as a couple? Mm, usually, uh, if we ha- uh, don't have any plan, right? Mm. Uh, probably cleaning house. Mm. In the toilet, everything. Mm. I go to the market. Go buying, to yes. <laughs> or completing the assignment for the work tomorrow. Mm. But mostly just uh, santai, oh. playing games, mm. reading books, mm. like that. Mm. Mm. The yeah. Also in coaching, there's no not really that much place to go. Right. Yeah. Mm. yeah, yeah. Bop, bop, bop. He's not. Uh, he's not a mall kind of person. Oh yes. yeah, he's yeah. more to nature. Yes, oh. and he loves camping. I see. <laughs> so if you're not into malls, right? How uh. do you buy your stuff? How do you buy your clothes? Uh, <laughs> usually, I just uh, if necessary, right? Just go to the mall, mm. buy the specific thing, and then go, go back. home. Uh, mm. okay. If uh, I can find it uh, at other place, then just go to the uh, shop lot, something like that. <laughs> the uh, like. Uh, Random shop somewhere and buy there. Ah, mm. okay, okay, okay. Right. Simple guy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, very simple. Mm. Okay, all right, mm. all right. So let's move on to the next question because I like to ask questions about yes. getting all this marriage stuff mm-hmm. and and all that. So Aisha and Farhan, first question would be, do you think it's okay for your partner to have very close friends of the opposite sex? Mm-hmm. No. <laughs> <laughs> Very simple. No. Right. Okay. 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 Mm. You don't like it, lah. If she has a, if he has mm. a friend of the opposite sex, mm. you will approve of that. Um, I would say one hundred percent no, si Juala. Yeah. But as I would like to say, boundaries. Mm. Boundaries is very important. As long as there's boundaries, then it's fine. Mm. <laughs> right. And as long as. Yeah, bukan bukannya dua aja. Okay. <laughs> Nya mesti ada orang dengan then ah. it's fine lah. Alright. Mm. Okay. How about you, bro? Uh depend. Uh for work and not in private place lah. Mm. Uh, mostly ada uh, for boundaries like and public place mm. and 
talking about work or something like that or right. just uh, drinking with friend or like colleague mm-hmm. something mm-hmm. like that yeah mm-hmm. mm. okay mm. but mostly uh i'm fine if uh, it's for work mm. uh, if it's for work it's good lah yes. yeah. yeah if it's mm. something personal then it's usually net ya kan ke arah lain <laughs> yeah yeah yeah, yeah. Fun, fun. Mm. do you think it's it, it's okay for your partner to have very close friends of the opposite sex do you think it's necessary to have a very close friend of the opposite sex mm. i don't think so i don't think so mm. Mm. i don't think you, it's necessary you already have wife mm. <laughs> yeah you already <laughs> why, have your wife why you need another person yeah yeah yes. mm. if yeah. you cannot share everything with your wife then it's not a good Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Because, I've, because I've heard a podcast from Aiman Azlan. Have mm-hmm. you heard of him before? Okay. He did say that your partner is where you share everything to, mm. where even your parents don't know what you yeah. share with yeah. your partner. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, and I take that advice seriously. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. If if you cannot share everything with your partner, mm. or you having problem with your partner, you marriage have problem already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. If you do, try to uh, meet another person opposite sex mm. uh, secretly or just a uh, friend meeting, but uh, <coughs> didn't tell your wife mm. or just tell your wife just uh, work, but mm. for discussing personal mm. matter, then mm. your your relationship have problem already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, sure. Because uh, if you doing things secretly from your wife, right? You have something to hide. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. why hiding it? Yeah, mm. why hiding it? You don't need to hide. Uh, if uh, you meet your friend, oh, hello, Aisha. I just today I go I see a colleague for work meeting something like that. Then mm. you know they give. Uh, oh, you want to follow me? Then okay, then mm. we just talk and Aisha hold drink. Yeah. Uh, mm. yeah, yeah, just order the drink and then we talk about the business and then go back and. Also can uh, introduce Aisha to the colleague as well. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> hey, this is my wife. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. That's oh. right. Yeah, this is how uh, it should, 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 yeah. be. should be. This is how it should be. Yeah. Yeah. Sure, sure, sure. Mm. Yeah. I have this question um, that, that pops in my head suddenly. Okay, let's say for example, right? Um, you two are in huge uh, fights. Lah. Mm-hmm. And then, do you share this among your friends? Same sex. Oh wow! Same sex. <laughs> okay, don't go, don't go, um, don't go on right now when you're married. Even when you were dating as a boyfriend, as couple lah, as boyfriend and girlfriend, do you actually share each other's issues with your best friends? Never, mm. <laughs> never. Yeah, never. Because uh, this uh, is personal. Yeah, it's mm. personal. It's personal. Mm. I never shared. Uh, if I fight my wife, uh, we have having a uh, argument. I never share with other people. When But she was your girlfriend, I know. Okay, <laughs> never, okay. because the, uh, I believe in secrecy between uh, partners. Correct. Mm. Yeah, mm. because if you share uh, a lot of thing with people, then if your wife or your partner hear it from another people yeah, yeah, yeah. then the yeah. trust issue become yeah, yeah. Uh, they might they might listen to the decision based on what the best friend is saying yes. rather mm. than listening it yes. with rational mm. mind yes yeah. also uh, they will say to you like you don't trust me you mm. uh, mm. you shared with your friend but you uh, airing bad Club, uh, bad, yeah, bad yeah, thing yeah. about me. Yeah, yeah, talking yeah. back over me. Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. Mm. yeah. It's like you, you're sharing to your friend, right? And yeah. then you tell about, oh, I don't like, I don't like my boyfriend today. I don't like yeah, my girlfriend yes. today. And then the friend will be like, oh, just break lah. You know. Like, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. That's mm. the first. The first thing. The first thing they will say. Yeah. Then based, I, uh, based on experience, yeah. Yes. It's true. Yeah. <laughs> it's true. Yeah. <laughs> but it can be biased. Yeah, they can be biased. But for me, my response will break. Why I should break? Yeah, That's my yeah. wife. There's a small argument. Why yeah. should I break? Mm. You haven't mar- yeah. married yet. Yeah. For yeah. for people that haven't married, mm-hmm. uh, argument is common. Mm-hmm. Mm. It's yeah. uh it's unavoidable, mm. right? Mm. It's common. Yeah, Memang it's common. macam 
asam garam. Yeah, yes. yeah. You, you will always be inside argument. Yeah. Sometimes you need yeah. to settle it now, or sometimes argument about food. Yeah. Mm. But uh, how you settle it is yeah. uh, the the most important way. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Correct. Mm-hmm. For somebody that doesn't know the situation, you know, I'll just break life, find another girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but that is common. Yeah, right? it sounds easy, but it's uh, actually not the mm, right answer. Yeah, not the right answer because yeah. uh, if you try to find advice from other people that doesn't know your situation, yeah. unless it's abuse, yeah, 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 unless yeah. it's abuse, abuse you just uh, PSA lah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, just. Tell another people if somebody abuse yeah, you, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. right? Because uh, don't be a silent sufferer. Yeah. Yes. If it's a life and death situation, yes. then yes. Mm. Tell, tell people, tell police or something yeah. like that. Yes. Mm. Don't don't uh, hide it. Mm. Mm. Correct. Yes. Yeah. Uh, unless it a uh, very severe abuse, mm-hmm. then you don't no, don't need to share. Yeah. Mm, don't sure. need to share. Correct. Mm. Yeah. Macam orang kata, uh, don't say lah, kain orang. Yeah. Yes. Then say like kain sendiri. Yeah. Sure. Uh. Uh, your points on that. Your thoughts on that. Do you share most of your problems with your best friends? No. Mm. Mm. Okay. Okay. Mm. All right. If it's if it's something really petty, then it's yeah. fine. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> macam muda petty, macam kita bitter je lah. Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah. Simple simple stuff. Ah, biasa lah. Girl talk, apa semua. Mm-hmm. But if it's really serious, mm-hmm. yeah, no. Yeah. Mm. Macam uh, If ha- my husband Si suka buku tu uh, Boleh lah share uh, Yeah yeah yeah, fine. yeah, yeah, that's, yeah, yeah. Right. that's fine That's, that's fine. Right. Uh, But there are uh, some degrees Where it's too sensitive To yes. share with your best friend mm. uh, mm. You know it's Yes boundaries Yeah you know that it's serious And mm. you know that it's sensitive So yeah. like you said Boundaries mm, Boundaries, mm. boundaries yeah. is very important mm. Okay uh, Farhan Yes As a husband right mm-hmm. How do you feel If she Aisha earns More than you earn If she holds a bigger position in her career, rather uh, compared to you, for example, if you are just example, you're a normal clock, mm-hmm. and she is uh, a manager or holding a high position somewhere, which obviously she earns more and she has more power in the uh, in the dynamic in the in the in the relationship in the in the marriage setting. You get what I mean, yes, right? Yeah. So, how do you feel about that as a uh, husband? No problem, actually. No problem. Because in marriage, uh, it's like uh, you understand each other have a uh, good thing, mm. have other career and everything. Sometimes they earn more, sometimes they earn less. Yeah. Mm. It's not like uh, <laughs> you need to compare yourself to your wife. Yeah. For what? Yeah. She's your wife. For yeah. what you compare yourself? Yeah. Uh, if you want to compare yourself, it's uh, mean that your self esteem is too low. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. yeah. People uh, that compare each other, even in the marriage, have self esteem problem. I think. Yeah. Mm. Sure. Mm. Uh, and ego problem, <coughs> the, especially ego and self esteem. Yeah. Because for people that uh, have good self esteem, mm. they don't don't need to compare because. Susah sama susah, senang sama True. senang. Correct. Mm. Yes. <laughs> If uh someday that you uh cannot earn uh, any more like uh been in accident yeah. or sometime as uh, you need money sometimes yeah. it's better than uh having more money yeah. than less money. Mm-hmm. Huh? Right. Yeah. Uh, if your wife earn more money, then we have more saving. Mm-hmm. Right. Mm-hmm. Uh, even though the uh, the money is for wife, but mm. at least we have saving. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, sure, if the sure. husband have more money, then they have more saving. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. It's a win-win situation. Win-win situation. Yeah, win-win you win-win don't need situation. to compare, <laughs> and you don't need to uh, like uh, putting. I'm the leader. I need to earn more money. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, There's been a lot of debate about this on Twitter. Right. Mm. right. <laughs> yes. What What about your thoughts, Shah, on this? If you mean the wife, yeah, yeah. More. If like you earn more than your husband, and then you are a CEO or mm-hmm. you're a managing director mm-hmm. somewhere, mm-hmm. do you bring that sort of uh, character from work to the the same dynamics that you bring to your marriage? Mm. How would you feel? I think 
I think it's okay lah. Okay. Mm. Because uh in mm. marriage mm. the uh, the wife and the husband <coughs> know their responsibility. Yeah, 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 yeah that's yeah. important because yeah. let's say if I'm sorry I was gathering my thoughts on right. what to answer tadi. Ah, <laughs> uh let's say if I'm a CEO and he's just a normal club mm. per se. Mm. Um I think if I I go home I would still see him as my husband as mm. the leader of the family. Yes. Yeah. He is the leader of the family, mm. and my job status has nothing to do with it. Right. Mm. Mm. And whatever, whatever things that hap uh, that happens like, like financial, ka apa ka, we will share together. Yes. Mm. Susah, susah, susah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> At the end of the day, you will still respect your husband as the head of the family. Yeah. Right? Yes. Even yes. if you earn more, even. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. there's there's uh, no problem actually because uh it's all about self esteem. Mm. Mm. Uh, if you feel insecure about yourself, then you feel insecure about your wife. Yeah. Uh, mm. yeah. Then if your wife earn more, then you feel insecure. Mm-hmm. Then the trouble begin there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah. True, true, uh, true, true. Yeah. You just need to accept that uh, sometimes life give you a better wife. Yeah. A good wife yeah. that can support you. Yeah. It's not like uh, you need to see the worst thing that can happen. You just uh, try to see the good thing. Yeah. You have a good wife. You have a great wife that have uh, earn more money, right? Mm-hmm. And they have good career. Why mm-hmm. don't you support them? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah sure. Mm-hmm. Just be happy for them. Yeah. Why cannot you be happy for them? I think it's it depends on the mindset. As yeah, well. yeah, yeah. yeah. It depends yeah. on yeah. the individual. Yeah, yeah. 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 self esteem. Yeah. 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 If the wife can be happy for you, why you cannot be yeah, happy yeah. for the wife, mm-hmm. right? Yeah. I mean, uh. like we've been saying this lah. Yeah. Win-win situation lah. Yeah, mm-hmm. the wife yeah. is happy. You're I'm happy, happy yeah. Because yeah. mm. financially, uh, we're we're stable, yeah. Mm. And I think the dynamics also okay. You okay, la. yeah. You respect each other. Yeah, respect you each know other. your responsibility as a yeah. husband and wife. Yeah. Yeah. It's not like <laughs> your wife is your boss. Yeah. It's not <laughs> you, the boss of your yeah. wife. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. So it's all about ego. La. Yeah, yeah, ego and self-esteem. Yeah? Mm. Self-esteem. Also. Yeah. Interesting question. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Because we have this. I have this conversation with a friend of mine back in. Back in my workplace, and then mm. he say, "Hey, let's show. I'll show you a scenario. What if, what if your wife is a CEO and she earns more than you? How would mm. you feel as a man? I'll be like, I'll be happier, because mm. mm. her money and my money. I mean, we, I can use my money, mm. she can use hers. Yes. Mm. Uh, like for example, if I have some commitments that we both have to work on together, then by all means we share our money. Yeah. Mm. But if let's say for leisure, if I feel like I don't have the money." If the husband and wife is uh, in a good relationship, yeah. uh, they don't mind us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> true, 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 true. You want them? I buy you for yeah, 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 yeah. True, true, true. No, no need to be yeah. to put ego yeah. something like yeah, that yeah, yeah. inside the the marriage. Need to be pressured, lah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 because uh, you you already said, uh, uh, forever in life and death. Yeah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. that's your off right yeah, uh, yeah, in 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 Christian. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, to uh, death to us apart. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In yeah, sickness yeah. and in health. Yeah, yeah. Yes, much yeah. like kami orang juga. Susah senang sama-sama. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, You, oh, you as a husband, <laughs> you need to do housework. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This yeah. is a, a big discussion here, yeah. lah. Yeah. 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 You, you know work. this thing that oh, this is suddenly a very random topic that yeah. came to mind. You know yeah. about there's a debate where women have to do everything, and then the husband just do dog kaja. You know, that's macam, wrong. Mm. That's wrong. Yeah, that's ab- absolutely wrong. Yeah, mm. because both work. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Yes. Mm. Both have a uh, responsibility. Yeah. Yes. Mm. Especially where women are always labeled. Oh, the women belong in the kitchen yeah. and such. So, yeah. 
It's a matter of responsibility actually. Yeah. Yeah. If the men want to cook, cook lah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's 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 not about gender lah. It's yeah, not about yeah, gender. Yeah. Uh, mm, yeah. It's about responsibility. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> it's all about the societal pressures lah. Yeah. I mean, mm, this is betul. this is um this is not uh, going towards the marriage life lah. This mm. is something general. Like mm. for me now, I'm 30. Mm-hmm. Um I'm not married. Mm-hmm. So everyone was like wondering When you get get married and all that, are you aren't you worried that um you're gonna grow old as a single man and blah blah blah? Mm-hmm. And ah. I'm like, why is that people like to pressure us? I mean, like why society wants to pressure if the way we live? You know? um, that's I can comment. Yeah, go ahead. Ah, uh, if people ask you why are you new married yet, you can say this. Will you sponsor me? Uh. <laughs> Will you sponsor me? True. I don't have money. True. For what I marry? True. Yeah. True. If I cannot support my wife, I cannot support myself also. True. No need to marry. That's just stay solo until you can uh, have enough financial. Yeah. Yeah. yeah oh. Until you're financially stable. Yeah. yeah. Especially because financial um, is a very important. A very important yes. in marriage actually. Yeah. Uh, mm. Also, um, if You ask me to marry, but I hutang. Yeah. Mm. I need to pinjam bank. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Who suffer? Yeah. Me. <laughs> yeah. uh, also, in the in the study, there was mm. done. Uh, the number one reason, the number one, uh, the number one ex- reason for divorce is actually financials. Yes. Yeah, financials. Mm. So if you are not strong enough, I mean that's why these marriages fall uh, falter and yeah. didn't work out because mm. of financials. Uh, that's yeah. why. Uh, back to the last question: mm. If your wife earn more, it's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. True. No, yeah. 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 no, no problem. Yeah. The society works. pun pressure lah. It's much like for single people. Why you not married yet? For married people like us, yeah. when are you gonna have yeah. a baby? Yeah. 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 I mean, after <laughs> after one kid, if you have, let's say, you ada anak laki lah, bila nak ada anak perempuan, mm. kalau nak pay, mm. and then after you have two, takkanlah dua orang, mesti ada tiga orang, but then after that, ada one, ada one, mm. you know. Mm. It never ends. It, yes, it never but, ends. But, it never ends. Uh, for me, if you are single, right, mm. just answer like this. Uh, I have problem with financial, and then mm. I haven't found a good one not a good one uh, mm. uh, a suitable one for me yeah, yeah, yeah. because mm. why you rush yeah why why, why the rush why the rush yeah. exactly. because it your own happiness why you rushing your own happiness exactly mm. uh, if you rushing your own happiness you will be unhappy yeah right correct uh, yeah. if you unhappy you, your <laughs> marriage and will not be happy yeah true. Uh, true. better uh, what people say if you want uh, a good Partner, mm. then choose carefully. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Uh. Better be safe than sorry, lah. Be safe than sorry. If yeah. you cannot find a partner, what's wrong being single? Yeah. What's mm. wrong right. being single? You just you can be happy single. Yeah, no, no, no problem. The, nowadays, yeah. there's nothing wrong being single. Yeah. yeah. No problem being single. You can become a hermit, ka, something like that, lah. Yeah, mm. you uh. can be happy married. You can also be happy single. Yeah, yes. yeah. There yes. are people uh. happily living single. Yes. And I think there's no problem with because that. Mm. not everybody can uh, shoulder responsibility of marriage, mm. and yeah. not everybody that married able to shoulder the marriage. Yeah, 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 yeah true, mm. correct. Uh. Yeah. Because. For my case, you know, people keep on asking me, "Are you pregnant already?" You know, and then yeah. previously, in my uh, previous workplace, their uh, previous colleagues were uh, looking at my weight gaining. You know, mm. and people are like, "Oh, the weight sick, ah." Like, ah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. And then I'm like, to be honest, I'm really uncomfortable with that question. Yeah. Sometimes, yeah, yeah. when someone is gaining weight, someone is losing weight. Yeah. It doesn't necessarily have to be that yeah. they are yeah. pregnant, yeah. kaba, yeah. kah. Mesti ada sebab lain. Yeah. Mm. But saya dah saya dah saya dah soalan lain. Like, yeah. Yes, but dah dah kah, dah biasa kah cang. Yalah, I mean, that's the society that we're living in, mm. unfortunately. And then mm. I also have this few relatives of mine that they really want to have children, uh-huh. but they cannot. Yes, mm. for whatever reasons. Only God knows, lah. Mm. Yeah, you know, after uh, even after ten years of married marriage life, mm. no Anna. I mean, to ask that question, that's very sensitive. Very, very sensitive. sensitive. Please, it's a very sensitive question. Yeah, but question. somehow mm. people mm. still don't get it. That it's yeah. actually sensitive. Yeah, yeah. I have a friend who, who, macam meluah lah, nyamada 
people keep on asking about yes. you know about uh, when are you gonna have a baby apa yeah. semua. Yeah. I feel so sorry for her that why can't people get it that it's a sensitive question. Yes. Mm. Not Tama. <laughs> people don't. People actually they just. Mm. They know that it's sensitive. Mm. Yes, but, but they choose not to be sensitive. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> so they, oh. but they keep on asking it. They, they mm. keep on asking. I mm. think I know why. What's up? Why the the opening topic because they are what. Sometimes I do feel like that, yeah. Chua lah. Yeah, yeah. pembuka cerita ni. Macam nak kata apa? Hari hujan tu pun nak kata bagus itu siapa tu? Kata kata hujan. Bila dah nak? Lama, lama tak kahwin. Yes. Lama, lama dah isi ikan. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's like because Arya, I went to Norma with my husband just to check my ovaries, mah. Macam right. Uh, I felt some pain this year, uh, so mm-hmm. just to check, I just just to be sure that there's nothing. I went there to scan lah, mm, right. okay. and then his colleagues are already asking. Dah dah ka? But but uh, my answer is good. Yeah. Uh, uh, tunggu lah, uh, <laughs> because uh, sometimes uh, Anna, uh, people don't know, children is a big responsibility. Yeah, of course. Uh, raising children is also a big responsibility. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's not about you now. It's about the children. Yeah. Yeah. And All then, your financial is yes, to your to children. Your children. Mm-hmm. Then also emotions. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. That's true. Emotion, uh, didikan, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, courtesy, yeah. everything. But because uh, when you see it right now, na. Even uh, this few few days, I saw the news about the Dajah Anam. They destroyed the school. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. yesterday. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Yeah. they destroyed the school. It's not the responsibility of teacher to no. touch yeah. your children, courtesy. Yeah, that yeah. comes from home. Yes. Mm. Yeah. If you fail to teach your children, why should you have children? Yeah. yeah, I know. I know what it feels like to be blamed for everything as a teacher. It's yeah. really stressful. <laughs> the, the, I think the teacher also know, uh, I'm more hopeless. Mm. Uh, because uh, you don't shoulder everything to the teacher. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. It's very. It's not like the today children is like nineteen eighty, nineteen seventy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Yes. Mm. Kids today are just. Uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> to put it simple. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, the the conclusion about the asking about children or about a single, mm. yeah, it's life choice. Mm. It's not like uh, I want to be I want to be married, but I want to be happy too. Yeah. Mm. So if I'm married now and I am unhappy, mm. what do you say? Yeah. Yes? Sure. Sure. Uh, yeah. Sure. So the the for the people that. Keep been asking for the children, right? Just get a uh, God will. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. That's what we always answer people. Uh, God will, yeah. inshallah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, because it's, it's not uh, uh, from us yeah. to decide. True. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some people cannot have children. Then even more sensitive, I yeah. cannot have children. Mm. Then. Yeah. Next one. Mm, how do you both see each other as a support system? Mm, I see Farhan as a very, very strong support system to me mm-hmm. because emotionally, he's there for me. Mm-hmm. He's, uh, I'm fire, he's water. Mm-hmm. Or oh, the uh, metaphor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> because He's the calm type, mm. while I'm t- I took jenis ada temper sedikit bah. Right. Ah, uh, whenever macam whenever I get angry, kapa, he's that water right. that will calm me down. Mm. So I'm just really glad to have him. Macam nang alhamdulillah lah, macam ini Islam yeah. that yeah. Uh, Allah jodohkan kami dua. Mm. I'm I'm sure we always we always tell each other that macam. I think ada sebab kita tu dijodohkan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Course, kita course. dijodohkan. Mm. I think there's a reason why uh, Allah sends him to me and Allah sends me to him. Mm. Yeah. So, bit by bit, I could find the answer, mm-hmm. and I'm sure he does too. Yeah, yeah. yeah so that's my answer. Mm. Nice. <laughs> mm. 
because so, uh, he's seen me at my darkest. Yeah. How my vulnerable state, and mm, yeah. yeah, and usually nak moon or ki moon orang dah nangga witness kita ni akan lari bah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. But he didn't. Yeah. He's there. Second date, right? Yeah, sec- uh, mm. third date I think. Third date. As you even yeah, remember, yeah, third date, third. <laughs> it was the third date That's where I expressed date. everything. Uh, I'm not going to disclose it here lah because uh, it's very uh, sensitive personal, yes. mm, yeah. personal. Yeah. so I accepted we, it yeah he said he accepted it so yeah. I'm like wow yeah. it's no like, problem yeah no, uh, problem. no problem it's I'm gr- very grateful yeah. lah that's the beauty of when you meet someone that really loves you for who you are mm. yeah. and not just it's because true. Or uh, beauty, yeah, mm. not just because of yeah. looks, yeah. or not for a statement that oh, mm. screw you, my ex boyfriend, yeah. screw you, my mm. ex boyfriend. Mm. I found uh, someone, mm. I found a replacement. No, yeah. no, no, no. This is like okay, Cupid got it right. <laughs> <this time. laughs> yes, and yes. Yeah, and I found the one. Yes, yeah. and uh, we were committed. I think starting after the second date, he told me that after the second date, niada yeah. simpan niat nak tu tak lah. Nice. Ah. So, <laughs> mm. Yeah. No mm. question, right? No, no question. No question. Yes. yes. Uh, If you want to make it work, it will work. Yeah, mm. just uh, how you make it work mm. is yeah. the, uh, the the question. Yeah. I, I uh. think I think we thought that uh, th- that we were meant to be because we felt that our journey to towards marriage was so smooth. Mm. Mm. Everything towards the job is the appointment of right. going to set yes. the date was so smooth mm. that kami dua dah si takata. Ah, macam. Senang. 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 Mm. Senang. No problem. Tuhan dah jodohkan. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. How about so, you? For me, uh, easy enough. Uh, Asia is my support, oh. emotional support. Sometimes where you cannot. Uh, I'm. Uh, I'm a person, a uh, very personal person. Right. Mostly, I like to liken myself as a hermit. I rarely share my problem with each other, mm. uh, uh, mm. with people, even my parents. Oh, okay. Mm, yes. Mm. I rarely share my problem because uh, my problem is my problem. Yeah. Mm. I don't need to burden other people with my problem. Yeah. Mm. Yes. Uh, after I married, uh, Aisha, uh, probably. I shared with Aisha what my problem, mm. what my insecurity. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody have insecurity. Yeah. Trust me, everybody sure. have insecurity. Sure. They uh, sometimes insecurity about look, sometimes yeah. insecurity about work, mm. sometimes like that. Mm. Everybody have insecurity. Trust me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. true. Mm. Yeah, for me and Aisha, for marriage, uh, support like. Emotional support, just yeah. talking, even mm. sometimes to meluahkan benda yang uh, not important, but you need to yeah. uh, luah, kan? Just uh, tell someone about yes. how how long mm. was your day at work. Yes, yes. 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 yes that's very important in marriage. Mm. Macam communicate, keep on communicating because yeah. if you don't uh, yeah. <laughs> go how, nowhere. How, yes. yeah. mm. how are you today? Yeah. 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 How How's how is work? work? Yeah. Yes. And pos- uh, if possible, please avoid your smartphone. I don't mm. know. Just yeah. focus on your partner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Focus, focus on your partner. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Mm. All right. Cool. Mm. Okay. So, mm, marriage tips to all married to be couples out there. What would it be? Be tolerant, patient, mm. and always communicate with your partner, because. After marriage, everything is different. Yeah, it's a different yeah. ball game. Yes, yeah, yeah, it's yeah, not sure. what you see. All this drama, TV tiga, oh whatever, yeah. and all this fairy tale, all this bahagia and some sort. No, <laughs> Have, no happily ever after. No, you have a lot of people to jaga hati. Huh? Yeah. You have your okay for Aisha, jaga hati husband. Yes, yeah. in laws. Yes, yeah. family some more. Mm. Uh, Betul, betul. There's, there's so many to, yalah, jaga hati orang lah paling banyak. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. yeah it's true. It's, it's, it's reality, it's reality. Yeah, it's reality. It's not about yourself anymore. Yeah. It's yeah. not about yourself, it's not about your wife anymore. You're about your family, yeah. yourself, mm. your wife family. Yeah, I've heard this a lot. Yeah. You not only marry your wife, you marry the whole family. Betul, yeah. betul. And the same for you, you marry your husband and his family. Yeah. 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 Yes, 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 that's yeah. true. Mm. So, kena jaga everyone. Mm. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. So, what would your advice be? Uh, for <laughs> married to be couple. Married to be couple. Uh, if you 
have time <coughs> set aside a time for you, uh, both of you to talk heart to heart mm. yes because uh, sometimes you just show your best but you did not show your worth mm. Mm. Uh, don't be after marriage then <coughs> people uh, see your worth then mm. the marriage have problem yeah right? yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. For my advice, always uh, even after marriage, talking is important. Mm. Uh, mm. Talk about your insecurity. This that's your wife already. Yeah. Mm. Just talk. Uh, if your wife cannot accept you, mm. who you are, yeah. then the marriage have problem. Yeah, yes. I, I'll be quoting Ayman Azlan. Uh, he said that just tell everything to your partner because. Mm. Even the things that you tell your partner, your parents don't know. Yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, there was this thing that popped in my head. Oh, right. Mm-hmm. As a married couple, do you guys have your own me time? Like, you, your own me time, and you have your own me time. We do. You guys do. We yes, do. we do. All right. Mm, so and I'm not. I'm not shy to admit that we do. Okay, mm. okay. What do you What do you usually do? Go out, girls day out or? Mm, yeah. Yeah. Uh, so. And then I would uh let him relax and play games. Right. You know yeah. because he works until Saturday. Okay. So his only time is Sunday. Mm. So yeah. 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 We do have our me time. Yes. Mm. Uh, you need to give me time to your partner mm. Mm. because you cannot be together all the time. Yeah. Mm. You need to give uh breathing time for yeah. your partner. Mm. Mm. Uh, some some day you just ah uh, I just want to do uh, uh to do alone relax mm. mm. tengok TV. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 For, for example, I would just uh ada masa. I go down, grab a book and read, yeah. and I'll let him scroll through Reddit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. Just reading yeah. everything yeah. So mm. because sometimes you need uh charging time. Yeah, yeah, charging mm. time alone. Yeah, sure, sure, sure. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. God willing, mm. this might happen. But if let's say you guys will have children, will you? Do you still ex- expect that to happen? The yes. Mid time. Yes. Alright. Mm. Uh, if, if we have children. Have uh, you guys talked about this? One, yeah. uh, one, okay. one, uh, my partner want to have uh, me time. Mm. I take care of the children. Nice. Yes, mm. I just mm. bring them out to taman, something mm. like that. Then, mm. like that, if yeah. I want me time, then my wife take care of the children and I have me time myself. Mm. Uh, mm. Because uh, having children, you don't have any time for yourself anymore. Yeah, uh, yeah that's uh, true. Uh, Correct. So, uh, the me time is very precious. Yeah. Uh, for your, your charging time, sometimes mm. I can quote uh, some animation la- last time. Uh, the the guy cook at three three a.m. Oh. because uh, he said I lost control of my life <laughs> mm. <laughs> after having children. Ah. Uh, I lost control of my life. Mm. Why uh, the wife uh, asked him why are you cooking cereal at P- at 3 a.m., he said, "I love control. Mm. <laughs> I uh, love control yeah, of my yeah, life yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> because probably they uh, mm. they don't have me time. Mm. Yeah, that's uh, his me time. Uh, uh, that, three yeah, yeah, 3 a.m. Just mm. uh, to stabilize mm. his uh, emotions, emotion, mm. everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. So sometimes when people ask for me time, it's not that people hate you. It's not yeah. that your wife hate you. It's not your husband hate you. Yeah. Mm. They just need to recharge themselves. Yeah, mm. right. Sure. Mm. Yeah, yeah. That's our thoughts on that. Mm-hmm. And then, uh, one of the I mean, one of the reasons why marriage fall or maybe they don't really work out well is because of um, communication, lack of communication. Yes. And some people have. They have traumas in the past, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, and they mm-hmm. prolong it to their relationship, mm. and they find it hard to express themselves, mm. to explain themselves. And I believe that Aisha has one of the ways for couples out there, or probably people out there that know, uh, that would like to help themselves out, or mm. yeah, mm-hmm. help me out on this. Or uh, where is their place, and how they can find help on that? Oh, find help? You mean uh, degree, degree? Oh, degree, yeah. degree. Uh, degree is actually. Um, 
it, just to correct you, it, it's not it's nothing to do with marriage or anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah I know, I know. Oh. It's just that I'm being general t- since yeah. we talk about. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Sorry, sorry. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, uh, just to promote lah. Yeah. I'm currently working at Yayasan Di Hati, mm. and you can find us on Facebook or Instagram. Uh, Facebook, it's called Di Hati uh, Grief Center for Bereavement and Trauma, and in Instagram, it's at the grief center basically we provide peer support for the one who is grieving who who could not receive who who could not grieve healthily lah right so it's basically a safe space everyone is welcome mm. just to talk and just to clarify uh we are not mental health professionals we mm. are not mental health professionals so basically peer support lah Yes. Uh, macam if they would like to go to a professional boleh je but yeah. tempat ya is for people to heal we have a healing corner mm-hmm. we have a gazebo down there for people to uh, walk jalan-jalan siya macam mau tenangkan diri boleh right. boleh je oh. and then our service is free ah. so anyone who is interested to book an appointment uh, is most welcome lah boleh datang mm. ke center boleh Uh, reach us through Facebook or Instagram. Alright. Mm, and apa lagi? Oh, cause oh, mau promo tak gitu. Oh yeah, it's the first ever in Malaysia. It's the first ever grief center in Malaysia, and bangga lah sebab it's kat kucing bah. Yeah. Kat kucing, and then uh, I would like to thank yalah for uh, 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 Uncle Zuraimi as I like to call him as the founder and the co-founder Iwana shout out to Iwana and also mm-hmm. my boss Nazwan for working hard on this grief center yeah. because we're living in a world where stigma is still wide yeah, stigma uh, nice. benda tu tabu bah yes. uh, macam also, bila kita nangis kita meratap oh yeah orang lain will judge yes. apa semua nak so in that grief center you just Go inside and there is no judgment. Hmm. Mm, you just luah ja apa yang you mau luah, hmm. and your information, your story will be private and confidential. Yeah, I see. So in in the future there will be more activities. So when, if you guys are interested, boleh check out the degrief website mm-hmm. <laughs> uh, at degrief dot com dot my. Right. Yeah. Right, right, right. Mm. Because because nowadays na, mm. like, um, when people lose someone important right, right. Mm-hmm. Uh, sometimes they don't have anyone to, anyone to uh, talk to, to and yeah. nobody understands yes yeah oh uh, I, will, i like to add also actually the back story of the grief center is a close friend of friend of mine which is the co-founder yang pun close friend yeah uh, a tragedy happened a tragedy happened uh, she passed away due to postpartum depression Oh. Uh, postpartum depression. So, um, in on in order to in order to continue her legacy, right. yang pun bapa, which is Uncle Zuraimi, mm, decided to create this grief center lah mm. to of her remembrance. Because whenever we go her, eh, go her in Whenever we go there, orang akan ingat dan anaknya bah. Um. Uh, especially yang paling affected of course lah yang pun family yeah. and yang pun close friends. Mm, yes. So, in on. In her honor, yeah, yeah. Uh, oh. macam, uh, to remember her lah. To remember her, then to help other people. Yes, and we want to help people as well. Yang, yang who's sama, trouble? Mm, who's uh, trouble? Who struggle in that sort of situation yes, yes, as well? Yes, yes. Oh, because um, because I've been grieving for almost twelve years already, mm-hmm. and it's not easy. Right. And I can honestly say that orang yang belum merasa nyesek akan faham. Yeah. So because sometimes. Ada one time I this is a bit personal but I'd like to share at the your podcast. Uh, I was he would wear my late father's baju bah to work. Mm. Okay. So I am me. I do dog. I cium bau bau baju ya yeah, and I just cried. Mm. Mm. So macam uh, some people they don't have any support for grieving. Yeah. Mm. They just keep inside themselves, keep inside until they. Uh, Don't care about the world anymore. Yeah. Uh, mm, because I've been suppressing my feelings for eleven years, twelve years now, mm-hmm. and to have this support, to have this open in Malaysia, the first time, uh, the first ever in Malaysia is macam finally. Yeah. Uh, and yeah. then, macam 
I'm having high expectation on this group center. My friend pun having high expectation mm. on this group center. So, mm. yeah lah. If anyone interested, can visit our Facebook page and mm. look at our Instagram page lah. Yeah. Mm. Okay. So <laughs> that's about the group center. If you, mm. if you or your friends, friends or loved ones who are need actually yeah, who needs help and also grieving. yeah, grieving and still trying to you know uh, seek help. Uh, so the grief is the place to go, especially yeah. if you wanna if you wanna have a helping hand mm. that to walk uh, alongside you. And uh, yeah, we would all in as what we say in our the grief center, like, you are not alone. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. true. Mm. Mm. All right. Yes. Yeah. So I guess that's about it for yeah. the podcast today. Thank you for yeah. having us, Mary. Thank, <laughs> Thank you for being here. Aisha. Yes. <laughs> Thank, you very much. Thank you so much mm. for the uh, yeah mm. for being here and also yeah behind the scenes uh, yeah. all the stuff of the recording. <laughs> we had a lot of problem, but uh, <laughs> thank God it yeah. it works today. So. Yeah. <laughs> Yay. 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 So yeah, um, episode nineteen of the Brain of Brain podcast available on YouTube, Spotify, and Apple Podcasts. Um, click like, share, subscribe. Um, this is the nineteen episode. If you have missed out episode eighteen with JJ on air, yes. Watch after this, uh, after, <laughs> not now. Watch after this, and uh, yeah, see you in the next episode. Bye-bye. Bye bye. Bye.